to style a rectangular shawl. Here's the ocean wave shawl with it laced in the front. Made with a simple lacing cord, just crisscross it. I'll show you that in a moment. Tie it at the bottom. You can put it onto the side like this or put the lacing in the back for another pretty look. Let's take a look at some other ways to style this shawl without the lacing. So here's the Ocean Waves shawl. You can wear it as a simple ruana, just laying over your shoulders. You could put a pin in the middle. You could wrap it like a regular shawl where you have these um, two nice points coming down. Another way you can wear it is just simply like a scarf around your neck. Feel free to play around with how you wrap this. Another way is to create this little, uh, little flower. Uh, you can wrap it around your neck like a scarf. Or here's a really cool way. You have it wrapped around and then you create these little angel wings that go in the front and the back. It's one of my favorites. This way um, is another favorite of mine where you just lay it over your shoulders. Um, of course, you can also take the ends and pull those to the front. You can either leave them out like that or you can tuck them in. Isn't that pretty? Here's another cool way, you kind of do this thing and um, you're going to have two points in the front and two points in the back. You crisscross it and you can use a pin to secure it or just wear it as is. It will hold. I really like this um, crisscrossing effect. And you can also take the crisscross and have it in the front. So you have these two points in the front. This is a cool way to do it. You can take it and fold it in half. And kind of double it over. Put a little shawl pin there. You can also um, fold over the top, one of the top edges wrap that around you and it's kind of a shortened version of a ruana or a, a wrap. I like this way a lot too especially depending on the colors. You can wrap it around your neck, put a little shawl pin there. There's so many different ways that you can style this and here is the lacing cord. For lacing, what you're going to do is um, take the ends and you're going to count the same holes all the way up. And I believe I went up like about 15 holes on mine. And then you're just going to feed your lacing cord through, get the ends even, and then just start lacing it just like you would lace up a shoe. You just crisscross it and then go into the other hole on the other side. So that's the Ocean Wave Shawl. Thank you so much for joining today. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and do that. I have videos coming out each week. If you liked it, please share it and uh, hope to see you again next week. Thanks for joining.